I got some stuff, and I'm sorry, there's sirens behind me. The freeway is like right there. There's a ambulancia. It is an ambulancia. Oh, that's a fire truck. I don't know if you can see it. I hope everyone's okay. Anyways, hope you guys have a good day so far. I wanted to show you guys something super, super, super sick. So my buddy Chris, who I met during Drag Week last year, um, he operates WAF Racing. I don't know if you can read that. Um, where they do a bunch of really cool stuff along with racing and other like things. They have 3D printers and they make some really cool stuff. He was super awesome and he sent me all this stuff um, for free totally and he even like did some graphic design work and stuff which we'll go inside and I'll show you that. I just want to kind of give you a nice little aesthetic on the truck and also look at that. I just put that on. It's sick. Now I need to replace the grill. Anyway, <laughs> um, this stuff is super cool so I'll show you how all this works. This thing is like super neat and for you carburetor guys out there. This will be awesome, which I don't have anything actually carbureted that's running right now to show this on, um, which that'll be for a later episode. I just wanted to show you guys like how cool this stuff is, but this is literally, I mean, for all those people that you have to count in your head, you know, okay, one, two, three, you know, turns. This does that for you. Like you can see, hey, look at that, rich, lean. I mean, it's just, you just spin this dude and it, it's awesome. That's super cool. And then these are carburetor hats. So if you have an engine sitting, like you're putting an engine together and it's sitting apart and you want, you know, to keep the carburetor or your throttle body clean, this is just a really cool hat and, you know, has a super sick WAF racing logo as well as he was cool enough to put the Daily Misfire on the backside. And it has checker flag all over it, which is super sick. I don't know if you can see that really well out here. I'll show you guys inside. Um, on top of, which this is all fancy now, but it's a spark plug holder that goes on top of a tool holder that goes on your uh, throttle body. So that goes straight on your carb stud like that. And then this sits in there like that and you can pull out all your spark plugs. I have my new spark plugs that are gonna be going into the Nova, uh, which is the whole reason why I started doing this video. Um, but yeah, you can put all your spark plugs up there. You have spots to put tools. Hey, look at that, that's sick. Like, that's super cool. And admittedly, I am one to literally like line the hood like everywhere possible in the engine bay with tools. And fun story, like the second time I went out with Abby, who is my wife now, um, we went to a Mexican restaurant and it's the first time she ever ridden in the Nova because it was a part, shocker, when, when I met her. <laughs> um, and we went out to go eat. And we went around a corner and I hear this ding, 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 you know, metallic -y metal hitting asphalt noise. And I was like, I think I know what that is. Park. I walk out in the middle of the street. It was a half inch wrench. Yep. Because I left it somewhere in the Nova's engine bay and it sat there for like 15 miles. And then we made a turn and it just did whatever it needed to do. And it said, I'm out. So... Abby and I always have that fun story of her going, what is he doing? Where is he going? What was that sound? And then you walk out in the middle of a street going, I found my wrench. Yeah. Dork. Anyway, this is going to prevent that. Not saying, you know, I'm going to leave a, not going to leave a wrench somewhere, but you know, this will 100% mitigate, 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 mitigate. That's the word. Yeah. Um, and it'll help alleviate or whatever word you want to use. Um, me leaving tools everywhere because this is just going to keep everything nice and clean and you know what you saw a little bit of it I'm going to put this back on the Nova and you can see it in action as I swap out spark plugs and we can also inspect the spark plugs because this is a super super easy way to inspect the stuff and also if I didn't already show you guys the Loft Racing logo on the back which is sick but yeah Huge shout out to him. Go follow him. I think he's doing a YouTube channel. Um, I'm going to link everything that I know that's his in the description below. I'll link the website where you can buy this stuff. It is super cool. Um, big, 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 big race car guy. I mean, and he's race car guy, racer first person. So um, definitely small business. I mean, all the good stuff that we all like and makes really cool stuff and knows what it's about and, you know, helps you with 
putting your logos, doing your stuff. He really wants to help you get your brand out there, which is sick. So let's throw this back on the Nova and let's get some spark plugs swapped out. And in case you're wondering, hang on, where's the hole? There we go. Bam. So not only does it work on a throttle body, let's walk over here. We got a couple carburetors you can throw this thing on. So you can also see it works on any throttle body. <clears throat> let's get this guy off real quick. That's heavy. Steel. I'm just curious. Look at that. See? Look at that. That's super cool. So if you didn't want to put your air cleaner on, but you had, you know, a spacer or something like that for, you know, your PVC, PCV or something like that. PVC. For your PCV. Oh, that's why it wasn't going on all the way. There's bolts right there. <laughs> Um, but yeah, if you didn't want to put this, you know, down all the way on the throttle body, carburetor, you don't have to, which is super cool. And it would keep it nice and sealed up for as long as you want it to, which is cool. So that one's going to be really useful for like engines I have in storage or like we're putting something together and I don't want to put an air cleaner on it, but we still have the throttle body on it. Like say when I had the Camaro apart for literally months. <laughs> Hang on, let me put this guy on there. Yeah, like when I had the Camaro apart for literally months, I just had an open throttle body just sitting there, and I'm like, this is not what I want. <laughs> I could have just put this guy on, and it would have been totally sealed, and no dirt would have gotten in there. Super, super, super nice. So this will definitely be on top of my toolbox being used a lot. <laughs> it's going to be like long-term build project stuff, just keeping engines clean. Which is very important and that guy i'm like 99.7 percent certain this is gonna go into our racing tool bag because when you're at the racetrack and you need to like work on stuff but you don't want to like one you want to remember where you put all your tools so you don't leave anything like this <laughs> hiding anywhere you just do that and now you know where all your tools are. You can pull that directly off. Super, super, super cool. So let's get the spark plugs out of this engine. I'm going to start swapping them over. I'm going to put you guys right there. And we'll start swapping stuff. We got spark plugs swapped out, and now this is the perfect time to be able to check them. Look at that. It already tells you front and back. I feel like an infomercial right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, it shows you front and back, so it's super easy to just keep track of everything. A lot easier than like throwing them over here and be like, okay, is that one? Is that three? I don't know. <laughs> They're all like this, and honestly, this is way more affordable to get something like this um, than the myriad of ones that are like aluminum billet i mean there's a lot of really nice like spark plug dividers and holders that do something similar to this but they're a lot more expensive and this one just works i mean look at this it's totally worth it um and like i said he gave it to me um he did all this for me um he's a really cool guy um and like if you want anything like this like i said message them at waff racing and they'll hook you up with whatever you want to build. And if there's something else besides, you know, this kind of stuff, if you have an idea for something, like, you know, you want a weird catch can thing, or you want some sort of mount or something like that, you want spark plug divider, wire dividers, stuff like that, you know, air brake for a duck, they can help you. <laughs> Sorry, Chris, I just like opened up a whole bag of worms for you. You watch this entire video and I'm gonna at least give you a little bit of endorphin rush by starting the car now that we swapped over spark plugs. We're gonna break those spark plugs in. Yeah. Let's set you guys down right here. Boop. These are somewhere right there. Ugh. 
That one. And that is all I have for you guys. So thank you guys for watching. Like I said, go check out WAF Racing and they can hook you up with some really cool stuff like that. Be sure to like and subscribe and see stuff coming up very soon. Hopefully we're racing Saturday. It's also like 90% chance of rain. <sighs> Fingers crossed, like crazy winds come through and blow the rain the other way. Rain, rain, go away. I wanna go race on Saturday. Peace.